everyone, this is Programming Challenge 3, the clock. Well, this is just your standard digital clock, except it's programmed by you in Arduino. Um, the idea here is, is we're going to have variables. Um, I assure you we're going to need two. Uh, so just like we have int i here, you are probably going to want one for minutes, another one for seconds. You're going to need to initialize your serial. You're going to use a large amount of serial.print and print ln combinations because you want to print out minute, sorry, you want to print out minutes, semicolon, seconds, print line, so you can go to the next line. Um, there's going to be a delay for the second counter, and there's going to be iteration on two levels. You're going to need to iterate both minutes and seconds. And you're going to need to use more than one if statement, or at least I did. So that introduced, let's just have a look at what that program looks like live. Thing. And when we get to a minute, the count in minutes is going to go up. Now, if anyone out there, I haven't seen it, but if anyone has figured out how to run code like this without... Um, creating brand new lines all the time, um, let me know in the comments. I would love to find out. On that note, the challenge is on you. Let's see how you do it. So, were you up to the challenge? If so, paste your solution code in the comments below, and if it's really simple or original, I will feature it in the solutions video. And while you're at it, why not check out some of the other challenges? So far there are six and surely more to come.